gone down to the job. Like, ugh. Anyway, so I just saw the full trailer of the new documentary on Lifetime, of course. <laughs> about Wendy Williams. Oh my God, my girl. She's talking about um, going to the neurologist, how she has no money. You see, I be trying to tell people, I've been trying to tell people before with COVID, we're going to see how we treat people with maybe mental illness or any type of disability in this country. Since COVID, I've been saying this, how we gonna, we're going to see how this government, this country treats disabled people. Now, everybody, I'm like on Twitter, some people's like, oh, that's what you get, karma, blah, 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 all this other stuff. I don't care. She will forever be the queen to me. She's an icon or whatever she's the voice of my whole like almost uh during in high school going to graphics in the city so nobody can tell me nothing about wendy williams but i really feel bad and it i think it digs deeper into these banks and these other um businesses and corporation who has um conservative ship over people and um I can't wait to watch because I am going to watch my baby. I love her. I feel so bad for her, whatever she's going through, all the things that she's going through. If it's mental illness, her actual physical health and everything, it's, it's, it's fucked up. It is, it's really fucked up. And I can't wait to watch. Are y'all going to watch it? Because I'm nosy. And like I said, Wendy Williams will forever be my queen. So I'm going to see what's up with my queen.